Hello everybody. I hope you all are doing well. Um, I am, as always. So, I want to talk to you all about something that's very informative. So, please share this out. Okay, share it, share it, share it, share it. Alright, so now, most of us know the fundamentals of driving or operating a vehicle would be to know different signs and one of the signs out there is a yield sign um, and I do know hey some people may not understand what the yield sign mean all right so they may have passed their exam but we can probably guarantee if they don't know what the yield sign means then that is at least one question that they got wrong on the exam hey so be it but I am here to help, okay? The yield sign is a triangle-shaped sign that is red and white, and it, have the, and it has the word yield in the middle of it. Some of them actually has a statement that says, cross traffic does not stop. So what the, will, the yield sign means to you is that you are a merger, meaning you are trying to get in where you fit in with the rest of the flow of traffic. Okay, now again, you may not understand what that means. So, at times you may have to stop, although yield is not a stop sign, but it may be necessary for you to stop because it may be more than one or two um, vehicles and you need to wait your turn to get in where you fit in. Okay, now these yield signs would actually be facing you, not the others but you and in some cases there are two signs and both of those signs will be facing you okay so that means you are the merger right so let's say again you don't know and you get in where you fit in you didn't hit anybody and no one hit you right all right so just go on about your merry way now if you feel as though that you have the right of way even though you have the yield sign and maybe the driver or the rider behind you you felt like hey they didn't let you didn't let you in you kind of had to make your way in it may not be the best idea to feel the need to maybe throw an object outside your window okay so throwing out your your soda your pop your cold drink it's not a great idea. So let me put things in perspective for you. A rider can be riding down the freeway or highway at speeds of 60, 70, 80, 90, however fast. And a bug, a small little bug, insect, um, can actually feel as though as someone is throwing rocks. I mean, it stings, like severely stings, okay? So you can imagine the feeling of a bottle, plastic or glass, how it, how it may feel, right? But the initial reaction of the rider would be to swerve a duck or do whatever he or she feel like they need to do, okay? Now at that moment, um, someone may feel like their life is, in, you know, is threatened, okay? So let's say this bottle does hit this rider it may cause several things, including the loss of life, okay? So he or she may feel the need to stand their ground. And what that means is, well, most riders carries around an object with them uh, for their safety, okay? It could be a firearm, could be something sharp, could be like these little tiny objects, shape of a round little thing, like a marble, you know? So. If you were to throw out that cold drink and, and if it were to hit, or maybe not even hit, hey, not everyone has patience like I do as a rider. If you so happen to hear a pew, 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 pow, 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 or bang, 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 or maybe hearing your windows kind of cracking or something like that, um, that's your warning to uh, put the metal, put the pedal to the metal rather. Okay, get out of the way because this is serious. But on a serious note though, you all, doing something like that can really cause harm. Again, I don't, if you upset because you feel again the other person's in the wrong, just go on about your way, okay? Just leave it at that, all right? But just wanna remind you, 
speaking of throw, throwing things out the window, real quick, I know I'm digressing here, but those of you who smoke cigarettes, which is your business, nothing wrong with it, that's your business, but um, I, I do understand that these vehicles these days do not come equipped with an ashtray, so if you need to, you know, discard your cigarette butt outside your window, at least do us a favor and check and make sure the coast is clear, so, you know. Yeah, it doesn't hurt, but you know, you don't really want to see a cigarette butt kind of come at you, you know. You know what I mean. Okay, so yes, back to what I was saying. So yes, if, if there is a case when you may be in a hurry, and let's say, hey, you're trying to get in where you fit in, when you should be merging, hey, you know, um, there's two steps that you should take to let everyone else know that you, sir or ma'am, is in a hurry. Okay, step one is to buckle up because... Yeah, you're probably going to be traveling at high speed rate, right? Step two is locate this triangle shaped um, little button on your dashboard. Now, it may be near your radio, maybe near your steering wheel, but what that does is it's going to turn your flashes on, your blinkers. And what that's doing is indicating everyone else on the road that this person is in a rush. So, let me move over and let them by. Or let me release the throttle just a little bit to give them that room to get on over. You know what I mean? So, yeah, we'll do that. All right? So, anyway, yes, if you don't know, if I didn't make it clear to you what the yield sign means, just Google it. You know, it will help out not only other riders but yourself. Okay? But on a serious note, everybody, Time, days like this, the weather is beautiful, so more and more motorcyclists are going to be on the road. And um, Hey, look out. Just just take extra time. I, I know we all hear, hey, look twice. Hey, look three times, four times, or however time you need. Pay attention. And you know what? And not just for the drivers, but riders too, other riders. I know there's some of you all like to ride a little bit more aggressive, and, and that's fine. So we all need to do our part and make sure that all of us make it to our destination safely all right so yes i'm out here riding safe so no worries on that i'm doing my part being patient letting people do their things because i'm just out here enjoying the ride all right all right i've gone for too long now but hopefully you all get the get the message and again share this with everybody because this is very important y'all all right love you take care and peace